y'all. This your boy Drez. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And today, I'm about to tell y'all five tips of how you can conquer 2025. Because this is the thing. I'm about to discuss a topic. You producers, y'all be comfortable and y'all be thinking shit a joke. But this music shit, it ain't a joke. It's 2025, it's right around the corner. And when you face, when you face, when you're tested with obstacles in life, you have to know how to solve them. You're probably confused when I say obstacles. I mean, when music is not going good, that's an obstacle right there. When your results, the work that you've put in, you haven't got the results. You, you expect you haven't got all the placements you wanted. You haven't worked with all the artists you wanted. Or you, you aren't getting the recognition you're supposed to get or all those other things. You have to know how to um face those things. And that's what I'm about to discuss, how to conquer all those things. One, one bundle basically. That's how we attack, attack problems over here. In, you know, in a bundle, right? In one attack instead of trying to approach things from three, four, five different ways. And my first thing, I spoke about increments in my video, my other video earlier. I'm about to speak about it again. You, we gotta, as a music producer, as a musician, artist, whatever you are, you have to attack problems in increments. What do I say? What do I mean when I say that? Well, when I say increments, when you're attacking problems in increments, you get to do five or five or multiple things, things instead of just doing one thing and clogging your mind and focusing on just one thing. When you do things in increments, let's say you were making or you wanted to learn the piano in one day. Instead of just learning scales all day or just learning pitches or notes or synchro papping or whatever you call it, you could choose 10 activities for that day. That might sound a lot, but guess what? You are capable to do this. And why do I say this? Because we have 24 hours in a day. And you could break those up in increments. You could go like this. Damn, this nigga playing me. A lot of hell outside. Yeah. First, you could choose 10 exercises for a piano. Boom. You could choose scales, chord progressions, ear trainings, stuff like that. And then you could time yourself. All right, I'm going to spend one hour on each of these activities. And that's how you pace yourself and you track yourself over time. Next thing you know, damn, I just learned about all this shit about piano in one day. And now what you do, you go apply that to your music. At first, your chords weren't structured right, but now you know how to structure chords because you took the time out and you learn how to structure your chords in increments. That's one tip. Another thing I'm gonna tell y'all for how to conquer 2025, you have to listen to that inner voice in your head. What do I, what do I mean when I say that inner voice? I'm not talking about the one that wants you to be, ah, oh, I'm depressed and um, bro, beat blocking. I can't make beats today and um, Nobody likes my, it's like, bro, you have to listen to that other voice, right, bro? Because I'm going to tell you this right now, bro. It's bigger than just getting a thousand plays or a thousand DMs from people saying they like your beats, bro. Cause all that stuff dissipates, bro. And I know you probably, everybody probably looking like, damn. Yes, bro, you have to really listen and pay attention, bro. All this stuff dissipates. What's, what's going to stay still, bro? It's that voice I just told you in your head that's focused on that bigger picture. Because you're supposed to have a bigger picture in your head of who you are and of who you want to become because that's that's what it's about if you know what the meaning if you know the meaning of becoming you know that's not something that's still that's in one spot that's something that's in the making in a process of developing something of becoming something that's how you should be so therefore if you wake up in the morning and you're like damn this music shit is not working bro or damn you feel depressed or you feel like you can't make a beat guess what bro that's just a feeling. You have to remind yourself, you know what? I have an empire to build. I have a catalog to build. I have artists that need beats. I have labels that might need beats in the next coming weeks. Because that's the thing. I told you, you're trying to conquer 2025, right? 2024 about to be over with, bro. It's either you about to die with your boots on, or you're going to end with a banger and prepare for the next war, bro. Because this is a warfare out here, bro. The survival of the fittest. I'm trying to teach game on how to conquer this shit. Yeah, bro, listen to that voice. So when you feel like, oh, my back, oh, today is not the day, bro. Just be like, bro, just keep your picture, bro. Keep your mind focused on that bigger picture, who you want to be. That penthouse you see yourself in, bro. Cooking up with your feet up. 30 fine hoes in that bit in the crib. All happy, all doing their thing. No, no discontentment or none of that shit. Everybody living in peace and harmony. Or, or your wife. You see yourself with a, with a wife, your kids. 
for your family. Maybe a retirement from music because you've done everything you want. That's how you conquer that stuff, bro. You start to prepare because everything is done in preparation. I just gave more than four tips under just one. All, all by listening to that inner voice, you start to prepare yourself because all, I just told you all that stuff starts to dissipate. All the, oh, bro, that shit hard. Yo, bro, you the goat. Yo, bro, you got all the beats. Because that's cool, bro. But at the end of the day, you have to keep that burning desire, bro. You have to keep the desire burning to want to move forward and achieve as a music producer. My third one is confidence. That's the center. I use third because confidence. Without confidence, bro, this whole information I'm giving you right now, this whole thing is going to collapse, bro. You won't be, be able to drive these things. So confidence, bro. And when I say confidence, I'm not saying you're going to go out here and just DM Kim K and say some wild shit. I'm saying shout out to Kim K, bro. You ain't gonna just go out here and DM her or just go say some wild shit out here to just anybody, bro. That's ego, bro. That's not confidence, bro. That would be ego. And a lot of people confuse egotism for confidence. When I say confidence, bro, I mean you're, you have confidence within yourself to sit down. Back to that, that second thing I just said. You have the confidence to listen to that inner voice and be like, you know what? I know what I need to do. I know that I have the ability to go this far. And that's the thing with ability you're able to go places with your desire and your that burning desire you're able to go places but a lot of the times you niggas don't have the confidence like i just said don't don't misinterpret or confuse ego or egotism with confidence 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 is within and that can dissipate too because you could be right here right now and be like yeah this shit gonna go far oh yeah this music shit gonna work and you go over there and you hear some bad news or somebody nagging you now you in a different mental space now you dark that confidence fades away now you have to find it back so remember what i just said earlier all that stuff fades away bro what stands still bro is you and you have to conquer 2025 by listening being focused because a lot of the things slip by you bro by not being focused and in the small common places and in the small common videos like this that people might look at it and be like oh yeah i don't need this shit i don't need this egotism i just mentioned that confidence right you know within yourself that yeah i have the ability to go places and i have the ability to change other people's lives around me while i'm doing what what i'm doing because don't you want to do that don't you want to make a change don't you want to be a difference for your family your community don't you have people that you look up to like what do you believe in because a lot of y'all don't don't stand for anything bro a lot of y'all don't believe in even yourselves bro right so that you have to find something bro that you want to do this for that's going to give you that drive because that's the confidence that you need bro and you know that yes i'm going to do this for my mom that sounds kind of yes i'm going to change my family's life Yes, I got a girl behind me that's pushing me, and she's solid as hell, and she know this is going to go too, and she's confident, and she know that I'm able to do this shit. Oh, if you by yourself, that's cool too. You should be confident within yourself, bro. That's a feeling if you feel alone, bro. You should know that, hey, this might look alone right now. I might feel alone as a music producer, or I might feel like, hey, these B shit not going anywhere if you're an artist, or whatever you do, you might feel like you're in the weeds. That's a feeling you have people out here but a lot of the times this is my fourth tip right we're gonna dive into this one as, as i as i go into this solitude that's my fourth tip the greatest mastermind of this world was always practicing solitude that's jesus and you can study him and you will learn why he practiced solitude yes he had his disciples but he he he, he sowed enough seed so his work could be done so he didn't need to be around him and that's what that's what solitude could get you to do when you're by yourself now you're able to grasp things because in order for a man to become an accurate thinker you have to practice solitude so you could think without any distractions because when you're just around booty all day and yes bro that's cool bro and the cheeks clapping yes and when you just around that all day and you just liquor and turning up and you smoking the gas and the, yeah zaza and all that shit and you on the beach your feet up and all that you around all that and bro how do you even hear your thoughts bro that's telling you that that voice bro if you, this ain't no ai scripted shit bro this is straight from the dome right 
How do you hear that inner voice that you try to shut out with all that noise? Because ju I just told you, bro, a lot of you niggas, producer niggas, and a lot of you want to be intellects and gods out here that want to be this and that out here, bro. You don't know what you stand for. You don't know what you want to do in life, bro. So you just silence it out with all this chaos and all this crowd and all this shit. But I'm giving you an antidote for that, bro. Right? I ain't hating on you. I'm just dropping gems, bro. You know what I mean? So yeah, solitude. Solitude, that's another thing. You can look all these things up. Another way how to um to conquer 2025 is remember the confidence gonna hold the middle steady. We spoke about increments. We spoke about that inner voice and the confidence. That's gonna be the solid base. Cause if you can't stay by yourself and make beats or even decide for yourself or come upon a decision by yourself, bro. Don't not even the people around you is gonna have faith in you, bro. That's what it comes back down to. You feel know I me? Mean? And the final decision of how to conquer 2025 as a music producer. Because this shit not a marathon, bro. Or you can make it a marathon for yourself and look stupid out here. Look, I ain't saying you stupid, but I'm saying this is how people are going to perceive you. It's all about perseverance, bro. Feel me? Yeah, perseverance. When I say perseverance, bro, the race is not for the swift. Meaning it's going to be a lot of things going on around you. It's going to be a lot of difficult things, bro, that you're going to have to face without grievance. Without being mad, perseverance, that thing deep down in your soul, pause, perseverance, you know that, hey, things might not be good right now, right? I might not have all these goals. I might not accomplish all my goals right now. I might not have everything that I planned to have in life. I might not be succeeding in life right now, but I have the perseverance that lies within me deep down in my soul. And I know that I can overcome these obstacles because with perseverance you could keep going over the obstacles with perseverance you don't stay in one spot because if you don't have perseverance now when bad things start happening when you don't get the results you were looking for now you're mad now you're frustrated now you about to quit but guess what a quitter never wins and a winner never quit winners always keep perseverance deep down in their soul right if they try something the first time and it don't work out guess what they do they go again and they keep going until they push that thing all the way to its final destination. And that's how you got to do it with this music shit. On top of 2025 going all the way down, you got to push it to its destination with those five tips I just gave you. Handle things in increments nowadays, 2025 going forward. Do things in increments instead of doing one thing or right? doing everything all at once. Do them in pairs and time yourself and make sure you're keeping track of the things you're doing. Listen to that inner voice, not the one that's gonna deceive you and trick you and tell you what you don't wanna hear. I'm telling you that inner voice that's deep within you, those forces that are deep down latent within you that you, nobody else, you need to wake up those forces and listen to that inner voice. The third, confidence. That's the center, that's the base. That's central, like Christ in this world. He's central. That's, what, that's, that's how your confidence is for your music. That's central. Because if you don't have... If you don't have the confidence to push that thing to where, it's, where it needs to go, hey, bro, I'm telling you, nobody else going to come and be like, hey, bro. <laughs> nah, bro, you got to stand firm even when shit not looking right, even when this shit not looking good. This is where solitude come in. You step back. You ease away from the crowd and the noise, and you look at yourself, and you be like, all right, I got, a re I got some rearrangement to do. That's when you rearrange, because you're supposed to be forever rearranging. Music is not just one, one something that's in one place. It's forever evolving like the world, as scientists say. It's forever evolving. So you have to be that way. You can't just be doing the same thing. So solitude, step back and talk with yourself. Listen to yourself. Perseverance, you feel me? Confidence, that shit. That's that shit that's gonna hold the base of everything. If you know what I mean. Perseverance. Perseverance gonna carry it the whole way, right? That's gonna that's gonna complete the whole package. With perseverance, you could carry all the four things before that that I said all the way through, and you set for 2025. And as you go by, bro, the new years will reveal itself, right? If you apply those and you apply those, you will start to acquire those, and you will see over time what the new years are gonna reveal. And I promise you, you will see, right? Make sure y'all like. Comment and subscribe and I'll catch y'all on the next video.